everybody, GT here from GT's Barbecue. Today we're gonna to do something really simple, really easy. It's a football snack, a little finger food. I'm gonna do fireball little smokies. So we're gonna do some little smokies. We're gonna wrap them in bacon. We're gonna put on some brown sugar and some other spices and a little bit of fireball. So it's gonna be delicious. I guarantee you there won't be any left. So stay tuned and we'll be right back. We'll get these ready. Okay, so here's the ingredients I'm gonna to use today. I've got a package of Little Smokies, a 14 ounce package. I have one cup of brown sugar, one half teaspoon of cinnamon, one half teaspoon of cayenne pepper, and uh, I'm just gonna brush a little fireball on there. I don't know, it'll probably be a, a eighth of a cup, something. Uh, I'll show you when I pour it in. And I also have a pound of bacon. I cut it into thirds, and I'm gonna par cook it. Uh, so I like my bacon to be a little bit crispier uh, when it's done. So I'm gonna go ahead and cook this for just a little bit, and then when I wrap it, it'll already uh, be part way done. So uh, I'll get this started here in a sec, and we'll show you how to do it. Okay, so I've got my bacon cut in thirds. Uh, this is a little less than a pound, I guess it's, three quarters of a pound. I just cut it in thirds and we're gonna wrap these up as soon as I, uh, I, I lightly brown them. Uh, I'm not gonna cook them too much, just enough to get the uh, cooking process started uh, so they're more done uh, at the end. So we'll see you in a bit. Okay, so we've got our bacon here partially cooked. Pay attention because this is really complex. We wrap our little smoky in a piece of bacon. Um, the Washington State Cougars play the Oregon Ducks tonight, so my neighbor's having a uh, man cave party. I'm gonna take these down here in a little bit. I'll show you a couple more. Once again, unless you're an Oregon Duck, you probably understand how to do this. Not a big deal. One more time. Little smoky wrap wrap. Wrap-a-roo, technical term, and you're good to go. And we're gonna go ahead and stack these in this disposable pan. So I'll get the rest of these done and I'll see you back here in a minute. Okay, so the little Smokies are wrapped in bacon. I have a, I don't know, about that much fireball in here. I'm just gonna go ahead and Drizzle some of this on. I guess you could use a spray bottle if you wanted. Okay, so I've drizzled these uh, with my fireball. I have my one cup of sugar, uh, one half teaspoon of cayenne pepper, one half teaspoon of cinnamon. I'm gonna mix this all together here. Mix, mix, mix a roux, technical term. And then uh, we're very simply just going to spread this over the top of our little Smokies. Um, one of the people at the party I'm going to go to prefers alcohol free. You can leave the alcohol out completely. Um, this is going to cook off anyway, but um just so you know this is just as good without any booze in it so there you go we're gonna go ahead and use this whole cup of sugar And there you go. So I'm gonna put this on the smoker. Everything's obviously already uh, somewhat cooked and safe. I'm gonna cook this probably for about 45 minutes. I do have my rec deck set at 360 degrees. So we're gonna go ahead and get this outside, get it on the smoker, and um, we'll head off to the party here in a bit. So see you in a few minutes. Okay, Angus is all fired up. I'm gonna go ahead and get these on right in the middle. I'll probably, uh, I'm going to cook these for about 40, 45 minutes. I'll spin them around after about 15. Um, 
as I said, if you don't want to have alcohol on these, that's fine, but most of it's going to cook off immediately. So I'll get these going. I am going to put the toothpicks in at the end. Uh, when I started this video, I think I put a couple toothpicks in, but I'm going to let these cook like this, put the toothpicks in, and uh, we're going to head off to the party. So we'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, so these little smokies are bubbly and sugary and looking delicious. The bacon is cooked. I'm going to get them inside, let them cool off for a little bit. We're going to take them down to the Coogie game, and we'll see you in a bit. Okay, so we're getting ready to head down to the neighbors for the big Coog party, and we're going to have a little sampler here. One of the other neighbors came over, Alyssa. Hello. Hello, hello. What do you think? We're going right. to try one of these. They smell so good. They smell like brown sugar heaven. They are. Okay. That's going to be hot. No way. Way. Oh my gosh. Way. Oh, so amazing. So it's like your childhood, you know, the when you do the wieners in the crock pot. What are those called? I yeah. don't know, but then it's the brown sugar with the bacon. And the smoky taste. Oh, mm. wow. Fabulous. Awesome. Wow. Fabulous. Hold I'm going to need like on. seven. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> really? Lucas? Oh, no, one more. I guess they're going down there, anyways. Sorry, everybody. Oh, wow, sorry. these are phenomenal. Gary, thank you. They're fantastic. I could eat the whole thing, Gary. There you go. That's what we're going to do. All right. Fantastic. Okay, we're getting ready to head out here. As you saw in the earlier uh, taste test, some of my neighbors have uh, already stopped by. I, I cannot even tell you how these things smell. And the ooey gooey, uh, they're... Mm. Tell them now. <laughs> you may need to make a double or a triple batch. Because these are going to be gone in an instant. So, anyway, thanks so much for watching. If you're so inclined, please like and subscribe. Stay safe, and we'll see you next time. Go Cougs!